We all love rose quartz, but how does it get its color? In 1987, geologists at University of Missouri, Columbia discovered pink fibers on the surface of rose quartz by etching into it with hydrofluoric acid. It was the same pink color of rose quartz, and they determined it to be dumortierite, or so they thought. Geologists at Caltech in 2001 confirmed their discovery of pink fibers, but what they found was it wasn't exactly dumortierite, it was just similar. The density of these fibers and inclusions, like iron, changed the color, giving rise to varieties like our top red and lavender rose quartz, while a 60 degree angle of intersecting fibers produces the six rayed star and star rose quartz. We hope you enjoyed this closer look at rose quartz. Let us know which minerals you'd like to learn about next from your friends here at Norcross Madagascar.